I forgot to mention this um, yesterday, but I sent the motherboard off. Um, I'm... I'm worried that Asus will not replace the motherboard. I'm worried that they'll say, oh, there's physical damage to the motherboard somehow. Uh, something I didn't see and make me make me buy either buy another one or pay for the um, repair, uh, which which would probably uh, be more than just buying another one. And right now that would be kind of bad because currently the only uh, the amount of money I have is like seventy dollars. 70, 70, not 7. Um, so, when it gets there, I think the I think the woman at UPS said uh, Wednesday. In the next couple days after that, I should be hearing back from them. Um, whether there's going to be a replacement or whatever's going to happen. Um, I am worried about that, but there's nothing really I can do about it, so... I'll come. I'll cross that bridge when I when I get to it. Today's vlog, however, is going to be about sleep schedules and catching up with sleep. Um, believe it or not, it is actually. Also, did I introduce the vlog? Hello, everyone, and welcome to uh, Sunday. Yeah, Sunday. Um, believe it or not, it is actually Monday at almost six fifteen p.m. Yeah, I think this is what's the, this has to be one of the latest times I've ever recorded a vlog. So yeah, um, the reason that I am getting around to recording the vlog only now is that the entirety of yesterday, well, pretty much the entirety of yesterday, was me catching up on sleep. Um, for the past five or so days, I have not been getting as much sleep as I have I had wanted to. Uh, somewhere around five to six hours a day. Um, usually, when I get off work, I try to be here around eight-ish and go to bed around nine. But that hasn't been happening lately because I've had to take the bus for various reasons. So I would get off at... Um, 7 or 8, get home around 9 or 10, and of course my tinkering self would <laughs> stay up for an hour or so, messing with something, trying to figure out something, and not go to bed till almost 11 or so. Which only left me with, at most, eight hours. And my body's used to ten hours. Um, so I had not been getting as much sleep as I had wanted to. So yesterday, my first, off, first day off in five days, I slept. And I slept hard. In fact, I think the only time I got up during the day was to get dinner. Then shortly after that, I went to bed again. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna have to uh, I'm gonna have to manage my sleep a little a little bit better. Um, major lesson for this vlog: just work on work on sleep sleeping more. Not not necessarily sleeping more, but sleeping at a more Just sleeping in a be in a better schedule. Yeah, I'm not sure if that that was English, but um, just sleeping in a better schedule, uh, better scheduling my sleep. Really a good idea. Um, I'm probably I'm probably gonna take like a nap or something here uh, in like an hour or so because I am feeling a tad bit tired. But. Um, I'm trying to get back into the swing of uh, going to sleep rather late 
in fact, extremely late in, in comparison to how my parents sleep uh, because I'm obviously working third shift. But, um, yeah, that's the major lesson for this vlog. Um, just sleeping in an actual schedule and not not staying up for an hour tinkering with something. That's a good idea. Anyway, that's actually going to be it for today. Thank you all so much for watching. Until tomorrow, I'll see you all later.